Hello everybody. In this video, we are going to show you how you can create a static blog, upload it to IPFS and connect it to your blockchain domain. This is a follow-up video to the first video we put out last week that shows you how to launch an unstoppable website on IPFS in under three minutes. So let's go right into this. I'm using templated.co for my website template. Thank you, Tara Bellus from our Telegram community for sharing this link. This is how I actually found out about this website, but there's tons of them. If you don't want to use templated.co, you can just Google free website templates, uh, static blog templates, and there's lots of websites that offer free templates online. I'm using a template called Spatial. So all I'm going to do is download it, which I already did. And then right here, you'll see my folder. And inside this folder, I have all of the components needed for my blog that I'm going to create. So the first thing we're going to review is how to edit the content in your blog. So this is what the regular template looks like. And what I'm going to do is open up a code editor here. I already opened up the folder. I'm going to open up the index.html and I'm going to start changing the content on this. So I like to put it right here side by side so i can follow along with what's happening so here it says spatial by templated i'm going to go in here i'm going to change it to my blog and i'll change this to blockchain domains and then i'm going to go down and for this i'll actually use content from our community forum but let's change this to blockchain domains. Let's change this to replace crypto addresses. And then down here, I'll pull from our domain starter guide a what are the use cases for blockchain domains. So now that I've replaced the text and there's still regular template, I just want to show you how this actually works. What I'm basically doing here is I'm editing the website. I'm changing the content on the website and what it says. Once I'm ready to upload that content, I'm simply going to save this, minimize it here. I'm going to go over to Pinata, which we discussed in the first video. I'm going to go to Pinata upload. I'm going to go to upload directory and I'm gonna upload this folder that I just saved. Upload. So now that my content has successfully uploaded, I'll go to Pin Explorer. I'll see it here, it just uploaded. And you'll see this is what the template looked like when we downloaded it. And now that we've changed the content, it looks like this, my blog, blockchain domains, what are the use cases of blockchain domains, and here's the text. So I was able to directly change the text on this website using my HTML uh, index, and now I have the opportunity to do it throughout the entire static blog. So let's say all of this was ready to go and it had all of my content that I wanted to share. What I can now do is go back to Pinata. I can copy my IPFS hash and now I'm going to go to unstoppable domains and upload it. Now that I'm on unstoppabledomains.com, time to connect my IPFS hash to my domain. So I'm going to go to my domains. In this example, I'm going to use test domain 12345. I'm going to select manage. I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to paste my hash here. Once I've done that, I go over here and I select save changes. And now I just wait for the transaction to process. And now that my transaction has processed, time to view my website on ViewBlock. So I'm gonna copy my domain, go over to viewblock.io, paste it here. Here's my domain page. Click on the linked IPFS. And there it is. Here's the website that we uploaded with our changes that we made.
You can see the difference compared to the regular template here. So that's it with this video. As always, if you have any questions, jump into our Telegram and we're there to answer them.